Welcome to another Simple Invest video. So in this video, I'll be talking about the differences between plotting on win plotting chart on Windows compared to plotting chart on Ubuntu. If you have seen my previous guide videos, I've just finished the uh, about three video. It's a three video series whereby I install, I walk through this uh, how to download Ubuntu, install Ubuntu on your new plotting machine, your new PC, as well as installing Chia and finally installing Swacha Plot Manager onto your Ubuntu operating system. And yes, Ubuntu is Linux. So after uh, installing it, you should be able to run Swacha Plot Manager on your Ubuntu OS and start plotting. So my, the difference is that I previously, my plotting machine was on Windows 10 and I've been running Swacha Plot Manager on Windows 10. I've been recording the timings on it and I've been very curious about the claims online that Ubuntu is uh, 10 to like maybe 5, 10 to 20% faster. Uh, like I'm not too sure the exact percentage, but I'm really curious to find out because everybody is trying to get uh, the advantage in terms of plotting. Hence, if uh, they can plot faster on Ubuntu, yeah, sure, why not just go on Ubuntu instead. So hence, I studied into how to install Ubuntu, manage to do it, figure out all the kinks, all the uh, little quirks and everything, and finally was able to successfully plot on it for about a day. So these are my results, which I've listed here. Okay, so to uh, elaborate on a bit, the these are the total time total time taken in seconds. So whenever you do a plot, let's say there will be some sort of log files. Okay, let me just show via this. Okay, so whenever you plot on Swatcha Plot Manager, you do specify a certain path for your uh for your log files. So in this case, uh, this is my path for my pl uh, plotting log files and the log files will be saved in here. So if you go into your log files, it's uh, pretty detailed. So these are the exact logs that if you're using the Chia graphical user interface to plot so far, uh, you will see it in uh, when it, the running log files when the plotting is being done. So these are the exact same ones that have been exported into a text file. So you can just refer to it for to study the timings. So uh, if you scroll all the way, so these are for the completed log files. So for I've noticed that the log files, once they are completed, most of the time they will be at 203 kilobyte exactly. So you just look for those which are 203 kilobytes. You, you will mean that the plot has completed and uh, you have this total time taken for the plot to complete. So what I've done is that I've looked at at least eight plots and taken their recorded their total time and I did an average of the eight plots to compare the time difference between plotting on Windows 10 and plotting on Ubuntu. And uh, to specify, these eight plots are taken at the end of uh, the job cycle. Be uh, how, what do I mean by the end of job cycle is that, for example, if you notice that whenever you start plotting, your first few plots always run faster. They always complete in a shorter total time compared with the following plots. That's uh, mainly because your computer has most of the resources free for the first few plots, hence they just happen to plot faster. And uh, when you are staggering your plots after the first few plots, the the number of amount of resources that your computer has for like the four, five, six, or seven plots will not be as much as the, maybe the first three plots. Hence, they take up more time. So what I've done here is I've taken the last eight plots before I ended my whole job run. So I've run my jobs for around one day, so about around 24 hours. And I've taken the last eight jobs of the 24 hours, same for this Windows machine and the same for the Ubuntu machine. So I've taken the last uh, eight jobs instead of the, the first eight jobs because I always, noti I always notice that the first few jobs always run a little bit faster. And uh, the, the order of these timings are from uh, the latest job. So if you notice this, shorter timings, they are from the last two jobs compared to maybe the timings right in the middle of the job stack here, which are which have taken a longer time. So it also ha so happens that the last few jobs also run a little bit faster because there's no more jobs queued after them. So there's no more new jobs to take up resources. So your 
machines, your PCs have more resources to do the complete the plots faster as well. Okay, so my PC specs are here. I'm running on Ryzen 5 3600. So it's a mid-range CPU, 6 core, 12 thread, 32 gigabytes of uh, 3200. I think it's CL16 RAM, so pretty middle of the road RAM, not really fast. Uh, I have two sticks of one terabyte, uh, Patriot VPN 100 Gen 3 and VME SSD. Those, these two are my temp drives and my destination drive is a Seagate Backup Plus Hub. It is uh, running on USB 3.1, I believe, the super speed USB, and it is an external hard disk. So my the general settings of my global my plot manager are this. I am running the plots six concurrent plots, and each plots so three con three concurrent plots on each NVMe SSD at most at a time. So I know I can run up to four, but in order to just make it faster, I I feel that three is fast enough. It's a bit faster for me for now. Maybe in the future, I might experiment with running four concurrent plots on each SSD. Uh, so right now for this test, I'm running three concurrent plots on each SSD. So six plots in concurrent, six concurrent plots in total among the two SSDs. And each plot is staggered at 90 minutes apart. So one and a half hours apart in between the, the start time of each plot. Okay. So settings aside, I've uh, maintained the same settings exactly for my Windows uh, machine as well as my Ubuntu machine in order to keep things uh, fair, to make as a fair comparison as I can. And uh, the results are very apparent here. So as you can see, the shortest times are shorter on the Ubuntu machine compared to the Windows machine. Like the shortest time on the Windows machine is 25,000 seconds, while the shortest time on the Ubuntu machine is 24,000 seconds, just a small difference of less than 1%, but the longest times take a lot longer. So the longest times on the Windows machine takes up to 36,000 seconds, whereas the longest time on the Ubuntu machine is only at a mere 30,000 seconds. So a 6,000 second difference between the longest times. And the next, longest time on the Windows machine is 34,000, whereby you can see the next longest time here is still at barely at 30,000, almost down to 29,000 seconds. So the difference here is about a 20% difference in the longest times, which is pretty significant. So generally speaking, if you average out, so this is a very simple formula. You take the sum of all these, of eight of these numbers and just divide by eight. And the same thing here. You take the sum of all these uh, eight numbers here and you divide by eight, you get the average. So average of 28,000 seconds for each job on the Ubuntu machine on all the same machine, uh, uh, the same as in the same hardware setup and the same plot manager settings compared to 31,000 seconds on the Windows machine, Windows OS on the exact same setup, exact same plot manager settings. If we take a simple calculator and we do the math. So we will should work up. So like 31194, we divide by 28236. Okay, so that's a difference of 10%. So indeed, the Windows machine takes 10% more, takes 10% more time on average to complete a plot compared to the Ubuntu or uh, Ubuntu operating system or the Windows operating system takes on average 10% more time to complete a single to complete an average plot as compared to uh, the same hardware on the Ubuntu operating system. So this one takes 90% of this, take it how you, how you will. But uh, in general, I mean, I, I'm not really good at doing the math in the long run. So all in all, I don't know, like maybe in a day, how many more plots can you complete? Mm, okay, so let's assume that the Windows machine completes maybe 20 plots in a day. Would that mean that you complete about 22 plots on the Ubuntu machine in 24 hours? Maybe, uh, not 100% sure. Maybe you might want to do the math on it, but basically, uh, yes, I've tested and my findings have reported that indeed Ubuntu machines plot 10% faster compared to Windows machines. And uh, that's it. So if you're serious about plotting, 
about getting the as much speed as possible, I would highly recommend for you to plot on an Ubuntu machine or Ubuntu operating system or any other Linux operating system if you're familiar with it. Thank you very much for watching and see you guys next time.